My name is Bill Sergio, and I am the leading writer, producer, and director of successful television shows featuring well-known celebrities like Mickey Rooney, Linda Gray, James Brolin, Margot Hemingway, Bill Bixby, Steve Allen, Chad Everett, Pat Finn, Bob Segrin, Lyle Wagoner, John Kelly, Marilyn Turner, Dick Gregory, Dirk Pearson, Sandy Shaw, Jorge Rivera, William Schaller. I'm listed in the book, Who's Who in America? I've been on television with everybody from presidents to Jay Leno. My work is famous and has been featured on Dateline NBC, the NBC News, 48 Hours, Inside Edition, and Primetime Live. By now, just about everyone who has spent a sleepless night has seen those cloying infomercials, those sucker-born-every-second sales pitches on TV. But recently, we were struck with just how weird some of the products are. So Judd Rose did some snooping to find out what's the story and how much is the tape. Meet the new king of late-night TV. Over 100 articles have been written about my work in publications like Time, Newsweek, People Magazine, The Wall Street Journal, New Woman, Money, Entrepreneur, TV Guide, Chicago Tribune, The Los Angeles Times, The New York Times, The Washington Post, and all the tabloids. I have produced a wide variety of television shows, from infomercials to television specials, like this sporting event with actor Gary Busey. The boats are going to be racing. Yes, and there's going to be a lot of celebrating. Down in the Florida Keys, everybody's shooting the breeze. The boats are running here and there. Everyone want to go home a winner. In the Florida Keys. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Every now and then you get some sticks and some bugs. But it ain't happening here. Everybody's gonna have a cool life, but if you don't know where you are, it's okay. If you got no hope, you don't have to pay. You're under the sun And everybody's having fun You're here in the Florida Keys USA boat race open Hey, hey, USA boat race open Hello Do you like the Florida Keys? How about that boat race? Yeah Okay. Hey, hey, sponsors. I want to thank Toshiba. I want to thank Micropolis and Media 100. Those are the three groups that came together to put up money to make this event happen. Now, a lot of people in America don't know about boat racing because they don't see it. Well, it's companies like that that's going to bring this sporting event to the eyes of the viewer at home, but there's nothing like being there in person. I was out there with those boats. I wasn't racing, but I was by them. Whoa, the adrenaline rush is something. So we want to thank those from the bottom of our hearts. This is my successful infomercial with Linda Gray, James Brolin, and Margot Hemingway for Tad James. Hi, I'm Jim Brolin. I'll bet there have been many times that well-known faces have stood up to tell you about different products, and you've been skeptical and wondered just how committed they are to whatever they may be endorsing or if they really even use the product. Well, this is a different situation for both Linda and me. In the past, I have avoided all commercial endorsements, and generally there is no enticement that you could offer me to sit here and especially expose my private life to you if I didn't believe in Tad James' revolutionary new methods and want to share his discovery with a lot of other people. I'd like to ask you to stop what you're doing for just a moment and to think about some of the dreams you have in life. Maybe it's to fall deeply in love with someone, or to travel around the world, or to have a career that inspires you to get out of bed every morning, or to make enough money so that you never have to work again. Or maybe it's the figure or body type you'd like to have, or maybe it's all these things. Now I have a question for you. How many times have you given up on your real dreams in life and settled for something less? Maybe because it seemed totally out of your reach, or deep down you didn't really feel you deserved it. Maybe someone convinced you you could never achieve it, or that it was a totally impractical goal to shoot for. 
How does falling short of your own personal private dreams make you feel? Now, what if I said you may never have to feel that way again? That you could make all your dreams come true right now? <laughs> I know, I can guess what you're thinking. That happily ever after only happens in the movies. But there may truly be a way to have some or all of your dreams. I know because not long ago my own dreams were slipping away. My sister had died of breast cancer. My marriage of 20 years had come to an end. And my hit TV series Dallas was over after 11 years. Everything seemed to end at once. I felt tense, confused, overwhelmed, fragmented, and I ached for wholeness. That's when I met someone who taught me how to take those losses and embrace them as an opportunity for new growth and wisdom. You don't have to learn anything, just listen to these tapes. Tad James helped me face the negative and limiting decisions I had made that were keeping me from my dreams. I found that negative thinking hurts our relationships, our ability to create, our ability to protect our environment, and our ability to help others and let others help us. You know, I used to think that I didn't deserve what I already had and what I dreamed about being and doing. And now I feel pretty much open to everything. And anything negative that comes up or inhibits me, I now have a technique to deal with it and create the path that I want. Because um, what he does, what he's done for me has been, um, it's changed my life. What more can you ask? This is my super successful infomercial with Bill Bixby for educational products. Hi, I'm Bill Bixby. Education is the single most important gift we can give our children. Our greatest resource is our children's minds. The old cliche is true. A mind is a terrible thing to waste. Yet from 1966 to 1990, average SAT college entrance exams have dropped almost 50 points nationwide. Where will our leaders come from? Quicken. This is the number one finance program sold in the country. It's so simple to use. It's as easy as updating your checkbook. We talked with the president of the company that developed Quicken. It's also been awarded more industry awards than any other financial software title. In fact, it's won 12 awards in the last three years. That's far more awards than anyone else. Awards for quality, service, design. Sergio and Spiegel Television presents SST Super Stories. Stories about products that may change your life. Today's Super Story explores sexual inadequacy, hope for a hidden problem. With your host, Chad Everett. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome to SST Super Stories. I'm Chad Everett, and our show today is about a topic that interests everybody. In fact, without it, you wouldn't be here today watching. That topic is sex and the ability to perform sexually. Parents, we will be holding a frank discussion of certain adult sexual problems and some potential solutions, so please use viewer discretion. Now, a high-quality, rewarding sex life is something we all desire and something we all deserve. But sometimes all our energy goes into achieving other things in life and there's nothing left over for sex. So today we're going to take a look at the subject of male impotence or lack of sexual desire or of sex drive and an exciting homeopathic product called Encore, which is helping victims of this problem by stimulating their sexual desire. American men, they may live normally, they may look healthy, they may appear to be in the prime of life but more than 15 percent may be secretly suffering. Millions of American men have fallen victim to impotence or the lack of sexual desire. Impotence and the lack of sexual desire, it causes frustration, it causes embarrassment, it even causes some men to doubt their manhood. Now thousands of men are finding hope, security and satisfaction with Encore. Encore is a male potency formula that, taken as directed, can be a safe and effective approach for some forms of non-organic impotence. Encore is a homeopathic drug manufactured in strict compliance with federal law and the homeopathic pharmacopeia of the United States. 
Encore is an easy to take liquid and comes in a handy dropper bottle. Encore may be all you need to combat a problem of impotence and help renew your sexual desire. I invented a tooth whitener called OxyWhite that I sold in this infomercial. Bill, is OxyWhite safe? Chris, the reason it's called OxyWhite is because it contains oxygen. Now, what could be safer than oxygen? I mean, it's in the air we breathe. OxyWhite is completely safe when used as directed, and it won't hurt the enamel on your teeth. This is my super successful infomercial with Dick Gregory for The Bahamian Diet. Right here on television, with all these people looking in all over the country, sit next to dick there's if i said to you there's only one thing that you can ever be able to say to dick gregory the rest of your life what would it be thank you for helping my mother and i get back into the way we should be ah joe ah joe don't be ashamed of what no, you're doing right no. now it's the no. finest thing you can happen because you know by your emotions, you're showing us where you were and where you are, and that it'll never happen to you again. we are a fine young man, and as Marilyn said a few minutes ago, he's quite brave, isn't he? Yes. Mm -hmm. Just being here. Yeah. Have pride. That's all the time we have. Back in a moment. You are no longer alone in fighting fat. In June 1988, Dick Gregory met with representatives of Congress and launched his war on obesity. I created this infomercial with William Schaller that sold subliminal weight loss tapes. Imagine this. Something as easy as turning on a light bulb that could help you lose all the weight you ever wanted. Sound impossible? It's not. In fact, that's what thousands of Americans are doing right now to win the Battle of the Bulge. I created this infomercial with host Steve Allen and astronaut Tom Stafford. General Thomas P. Stafford is the astronaut who commanded the U.S. Soviet Apollo Soyuz space mission. And since retiring from the Air Force, General Stafford sits on the boards of several major corporations and continues to consult for the U.S. government. He has maintained a very high interest in raising the standards of American education. I've seen lots of materials that, that approach the subject, but I've seen none that will echo what Dr. D Draper has been able to put forth in these tapes. And I just wish that every junior high school, high school and college would have these so they could get the most out of the people. A short while ago, I had an opportunity to talk with the producer of this program, William Sergio. We felt that we wanted to make her tapes available to as many people as possible. And say, Brother Dave, don't you want to be normal? And I look at them, I just say, what's normal? <laughs> I'm the little crip boy. Don't I have a mama, don't I have a daddy. I'm the little crip boy, begging to die. I know where I've been. And I know where I'm going. Amen. In the 33 years that the old time gospel hour has been on the air, we have never received such a response as when David Ring spoke here. You see, David has cerebral palsy. Yet, by the grace of God, this crippling disease has not stopped him. More importantly, David Ring is being used of God to make a difference in the lives of so many people. You probably know someone right now who needs to tune in, to hear his testimony, someone depressed, someone despondent, someone afflicted emotionally or physically. David Ring will make you laugh. He'll also make you cry if you're like me. I know this. No one watching today will remain unchanged. So if you or anyone you know is going through trials and tribulations, needs a special touch, stay tuned. I suggest that you pick your phone up now and call somebody and have them join with you in watching this special program. And now, I was the first person to ever sell alpha hydroxy acids for skin care on national television. Now, Bill, you are a successful television producer. Why did you decide to do a show on Novacell? Alfie and I have read a lot about alpha hydroxy compound, done quite a bit for both of us, and we decided to produce the show, and the rest is history. I created this infomercial for authors of the best-selling book, Life Extension. 
You are about to meet two of the most extraordinary, dynamic, and dedicated research scientists at work today in the field of aging and life extension, Dirk Pearson and Sandy Shaw. After nearly 20 years of total immersion in the subject, they are convinced that human aging mechanisms can be retarded and to some extent reversed. Following their first best-selling book, Life Extension, hundreds of articles about Sandy and Dirk appeared in national publications. At MIT, he worked on a triple major, biology, psychology, and physics. Dirk has worked in all of the manned U.S. aerospace programs, from Gemini to the shuttle. He has received numerous awards from NASA and the U.S. Air Force for his penetrating quality control and safety analysis. He wrote much of the safety manual for the material processing laboratory aboard the shuttle. Sandy graduated from UCLA with a degree in chemistry, specializing in biochemistry, and she's been conducting biomedical research for the past 20 years. For Sandy and Dirk, science is not merely a livelihood, it's a way of life. I created this infomercial with Olympic gold medalist Bob Segrin selling Ed Beckley's real estate course. Hi, I'm Ed Beckley, and I've got a million dollar formula that can put thirty to eighty five thousand dollars cash in your pocket in the next twelve months. This formula allowed Grant Turner to go from being bankrupt to making over a half a million dollars in just three years. It allowed Alan Georgine Strauss to develop a $1,500 a month income and put $10,000 cash in their pockets without quitting their regular jobs. 16-year-old Paul Petricola put over $60,000 cash in his pocket and went on to develop an over $400,000 net worth. And Nick Gerenio, who became a millionaire in just four years using my million-dollar formula. Yes, you can get rich with this million-dollar formula starting out part-time whether you have cash or credit. I know. I did it. You can too. I let it all hang out in front of my own cameras in this infomercial for my Malibu diet. The Malibu diet gave me back my life and it was the answer to my prayers. That's fantastic, oh, isn't it? It sure really? is. Really? Well, I want to introduce the man responsible for the Malibu diet. First of all, let me tell you a little bit about him. He's a successful developer of new products who, like millions of Americans, has battled with weight most of his life. That is, until now. Let's meet Bill Sergio. Good to have you here, Bill. Thank you. Good to be here. How did you come to develop the Malibu diet in the first place? Well, I've fought a weight problem most of my adult life, and a few years ago, my mom, before she passed away, was fighting a long battle with cancer, and it was a, a very stressful time for me, and I began to put on a, a lot of extra weight. Um, at the time, my wife, Alfie, you know, she always stuck by me, but I knew I no longer looked like the person she had married. You know, we have a picture of you yeah. showing what you looked like then. Can we show it to the audience? Do you mind? Go ahead. Okay. Wow. <laughs> mm. I've been better than most people. Big difference. How much weight have you lost, Bill? I've lost 49 pounds. This is my successful infomercial for Verbal Judo. Verbal Judo was so good that the Los Angeles City Council unanimously approved Verbal Judo to train the entire Los Angeles Police Department. More powerful than the fiercest karate kid. Hey! More persuasive than bursting through bricks. More effective than the physical martial arts is Verbal Judo. The Martial Arts of the Spoken Word. In the next half hour, you will learn techniques more powerful than the ones you've just seen here. George Thompson is a black belt who trains policemen in the martial arts, but not ordinary kicking, punching, and chopping. George Thompson teaches cops the martial arts of the spoken word that he calls verbal judo. Thompson trains cops how to use their mouth instead of their knife sticks or guns to handle virtually any situation. His verbal judo techniques are so powerful that over 50,000 police officers and federal agents were required to take it. Everything, in fact, you're going to hear today will do something measurably to decrease your personal stress. Because what I teach is a warrior's habit of mind. I do not teach PR, I do not teach reasoning, and I do not teach debate. What I teach is an ancient art lost and rarely taught anymore except in my class, and that is the art of persuasion. How to get people to do what you want them to do when they have no inclination to do it. I created this infomercial with host Pat Finn selling a course to turn your kids into a human calculator. After learning speed math, your child will confidently show their skills to the class. Speed math covers multiplication, division, 
addition, subtraction, positive and negative numbers, finding square roots, and much more, including general techniques that can be used in everything from trigonometry to calculus. Your children will learn how to check answers on exams so they'll get A's. Just imagine how this will improve their chance for success in life. Speed math improves concentration, understanding, creativity, and self-esteem. Your children will perform like geniuses to their classmates, doing lightning-fast calculations in their heads. I created this infomercial with host Pat Finn, selling a course to give you a mega memory. This is my super successful infomercial with Lyle Wagoner, selling a drug called Wybron. Is this product called Wybron? It's manufactured by Smith Davis Pharmacal. Now, it's been reported to be changing people's lives by stimulating sexual desire. This is my successful infomercial with Lyle Wagner for a liquid breast enlarger I invented. Now, you claim to have perfected a product here that, when applied, will increase the bus size without surgery. Is that correct? Speed Freaks, which became the winner of the 1989 Telly Award. Thank you. Well, I think all of us have seen those late night television commercials uh, that run two minutes or more that uh, sell us uh, things all the way from never dulling knives to uh, uh, an incredible new weight loss drug or uh, things of that nature. They all get our attention and uh, they all tell us to have our MasterCard and visas ready to go. Well, our first guest is indeed the mastermind behind many of those amazing products and incredible sellers. You don't know him, but you know his products. Please welcome Bill Sergio to Kelly and Company. <laughs> 